Hello, dear students. Welcome to this video e-learning program as produced by Rwanda for Technics. My name is Rwagasana Mark, a trainer in Masonori. Today, we are going to run together about terrazzo pavement. Within these models, we have to discuss about what is a terrazzo, introduction to terrazzo, the different types of material, tools, and equipment used in terrazzo construction. And also, finally, we will see how to construct a terrazzo pavement, which is the pressing terrazzo pavement, okay, terrazzo flooring, okay? So, what is a terrazzo pavement? In general, a terrazzo pavement, it is a hard wearing surface and durable floor, which consists of marble chips or chips embedded in the mortar and then grounded and well pushed in order to provide a good pavement, which is very shiny. So normally, a terrazzo pavement as a, a type of a building which is finished by a terrazzo. Terrazzo can be used to finish a wall. It can be used to finish stairs, as well as the pavement that we're going to talk about. So one of the materials used in terrazzo pavement or terrazzo ingredient here, we have different types of material or uh, terrazzo ingredient. Let's start from the aggregate used in the terrazzo pavement. So the kind of aggregate used in the terrazzo pavement are what you call the chips. The chips can be either marble chips or granite chips or quartz chips or those chips can be combined together in order to form the aggregate used for terrazzo pavement. So here we have the marble chips with various colors. So we have the marble chips of white color. Those are what you call the marble chips of white color. So we have another types of marble chips having the brown color. And here we have the black one. Okay, those are what you call the marble chips. Another ingredient of terrazzo is what you call matrix. In matrix, we have cementious matrix and the resinous matrix. So here we are going to use cementious matrix. So those are what you call cementious matrix in the types of ordinary portal and cement. This is a portal and cement. Here we have ordinary white cement. Another ingredient that we can use in the terrazzo construction depends on the our desire, we may need to improve the color of our pavement. So if we want to change the color of our pavement, we may need to provide a pavement of red color. For that case, we will need to use oxide, oxide like this in the form, in the color of red, this is what you call the pigment, okay? And normally, the pigment used in the pavement construction in order to improve the color. So here, we have another type of pigment, which is in the form of green color. We can use this pigment in order to provide a terrazzo pavement with, with this color, okay? So our practice, 
We are going to use those two types of pigment, red color and green color pigment. So about the ingredients used in the terrazzo pavement, we can finish the here. But when we talk about the function of each ingredient, especially for cement, cement as material, those play the big role of combining together or grouping together the aggregate or those marble chips. Okay? So let's talk about the tools used in the terrazzo pavement. One of the tools that we can use in the terrazzo pavement is a split level. This is just used for checking either horizontal and vertical, but in the terrazzo pavement, we will use this to check horizontality. Here, we have a thrower. This thrower is used to spread the motor, I mean the concrete terrazzo, on the surface. Here we have a building square, or a Buddha square. This is used for checking the right angle. We have a spade, the sort of a spade. This is just used for mixing the terrazzo ingredient. That is a wooden throat. The wooden throat is just used for beating, the process of beating and floating the terrazzo paste. This is a steel throat. When we just finish to pour a terrazzo, we will need to finish our terrazzo with this steel throat. This is a tape measure. This tape measure is just used for taking the measurement. So here we have a gorge box. This is a wooden gorge box, which has the standard dimension of, which corresponding to the volume of one bag of cement. The size of this gorge box, the width of this gorge box is 30, the length is 30, which means it is squared, okay? But the depth of this gorge box is 40 centimeters, okay? So, which means the total volume of this gorge box is equal to 0 0.035. And some of it. This is the volume of one bag of cement. It is used in batching. So here we have what you call straight edge. This is a strip which is used to revel our pavement. When we just finish to pour and beating, we need to revel our pavement surface. Normally, we just seen about the tools, okay? So when we are going to perform this practice, it is better, it is very important to protect our body, okay? That is why we will need those grooves in order to protect our hands, and then also, we will need this helmet. 
This is just used to protect a head from any object which can fall from the top to the head. So we have another equipment used in terrazzo construction. Let's start from the one equipment used in terrazzo compaction. <coughs> this is a compactor roller machine. This machine is used to compact or to embed those ingredients into, into the motor, okay? That is a wheelbarrow. It is just used for transporting the material from one place to another place. <coughs> this is what you call trazo grinding machine. This is just used for cutting the Mabo exposed the, to the top surface of terrazzo pavement. Because a terrazzo pavement, when you're constructing it, we will need to expose the marble chips. Those marble chips are just cut off by those discs. At the first stage, we use the disc of the coarse grade. Okay? But sometime, when we need to finish our terrazzo properly, the grinding of a trazo for once it is, not, it is not very important. That we need to cut the trazo or to finish the trazo for the setting into the stage. That is why we need the first grinding, the second grinding, and then finally we push our trazo. For the second grinding, we need to use this stone. Those are the abrasive. It is the kind of abrasive stone with the fine grade. So this is what you call carburandum stone. So this is a cover which support this carburandum stone on this machine. We will see how to fix it on the machine. So here we have Another machine. This is a hand grinding machine. It is just used sometime for finishing the, the cutting. Where we have the small piece or the small member of, of breeding that we need a small machine like this. And also, this machine can support this rubber disc. We will need to use this rubber disc to polish our surface. Dear student, I think about the tools, equipment, and the terrazzo ingredient or material use in trazo construction, there is no problem. So now, let us see how to perform our terrazzo pavement. <laughs> 